Hey guys, what's good? It's your boy JRP Cage and welcome back to my channel and we got my brother here as well joining in the unboxing and as usual we're gonna be unboxing another one by Hot Toys and this one is the Hulk Buster like this box is so huge I think you guys are we won't be able to see it completely but yeah it's blocking our way as well so this unboxing is another one by Hot Toys and this is the Hulk Buster from the movie Infinity War when Bruce wasn't able to transform to Hulk because Hulk was a scaredy cat. He wasn't able to come out because he got scared by Thanos. So this um, code is the PPS005. So this is the first Hulk buster before, supposed to be, um, Tony was built build it to beat up the Hulk, but Bruce was the one wearing it. So this is a 1 to 6 scale. Like, honestly, it doesn't even look like a 1 to 6 scale. It's a bit too big for a 1 to 6 scale. And we're going to compare it later with the size with the other figurines that we have. So, this is how it looks like from the front side. This is how it looks like from the side view. And all the details are written in the back. It's up to you guys if you're going to read it or not. So, and that another view is written this way. And, of course, the front side. Before we continue unboxing this one, don't forget to subscribe to the YouTube channel. Click that notification bell. A bell bell and also like and follow the facebook page and also click the notification bell on my facebook page because every now i'm doing live streams and also don't forget to check out the previous videos from episode one uh i mean not episode one yeah from the episode uh, six and seven when it was my last days on expo from the jason concert and the neo concert just check it out from those previous vlogs or you can check out the other previous video when we unbox spider-man all right, let's start removing this in its box. Um, we're just gonna slide it up. We just slide this up. So, dude, help me out because you'll never know it's my fault. So we're gonna slide this one up here. Um, yeah, we just like slide that part. So this is the starting of the Hulk Buster. You can see the design from this part. So what we're going to do is, it might fall, so we're, we're just going to take it out one by one and place it here and then introduce it to you guys. So, just give us a second. Moments later. What the heck are you doing? Anyway, so we took it out from the box and this is how big is the Hulk Buster. Like, what the heck? It's like so big and this is the only features that, the only features is the two hands. And holy camoly, this is a very big, I can't even tell, I, I don't even know how is this a 1 to 6 scale. Like honestly, it looks huge. Like it's bigger than the Hulk we have and the Thanos we have. So we're going to introduce those later. But dang, that is one huge Hulk Buster. This is the Hulk Buster that we wanted to get a long time. But I don't know if it, we can also move it no, more. Nothing. Or it's just like this. It's just the arms. Because he doesn't really move that much when you're watching the movie, right? But dang. As much as I know that this Hulkbuster, there are some lights uh, you can attach to this. Just so we don't remember where is the light, where it's supposed to be active. But yeah, there's lights in this thing. Uh, we just need to figure out where the lights are located. Because we didn't check the instruction, man. We just got excited when we took it out of the box. So uh, give us one moment. We'll just figure out the lights. Uh. So I think we found out what the heck are you doing now? Anyways, we just found I found out where the lights are, so my brother will switch it on. So the lights are located at the back side. There's a lights from the front <clears throat> and the back, so it's located from there. So the battery's already located inside, and once we switch it on, you will see where the lights will activate. Dun, 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 dun. So there, oh, that's right. So there's where all the lights are. The lights will be located from his uh, front side of his chest and from his arms and from the legs and god dang, even from the helmet as well. So you, from the head part, you can see all the lights. Can you stop spinning? Oh. Okay, so from his head, you can see this is the only, this is the only part you can move like left and right. But his, I just noticed the shape of his head is like facing like this, which is weird. You can switch off the light, dude. It's kind of bright. Or you're just gonna leave it on. Yeah, we're just gonna leave it on. But honestly, this guy is big. So the only thing we're gonna do is, since that he only has these types of features, I think this is might be a small unboxing video for this episode because we're amazed how big is the Hulk Buster. 
this is the um, I think this is Mark Mark Two for the Hulkbuster because the first Hulkbuster Iron Man Ward is when battling the Hulk in um, Age of Ultron. That's what I remember. So we, this is how you remove it to change its hand. So we just need to pull this part out. Um, yeah, you just we just need to, we're gonna we're gonna show you how to change it. We just need to figure out how to remove it. So we're just gonna remove this. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Basically, uh, give us one moment. Eventually. So there you have it. We changed his hands and they were hard. It, it kind of hurt. So this is how big his hands are. So we put it in the, uh, the position that his hands are closed. It's much better because he looks grumpier. It looks Gucci in that point. So my brother's enjoying playing with the lights. I was actually quite surprised that these are the only features. I just, I'm wondering why does he have only four fingers? Is it supposed to be five fingers? No. Okay, so we're going to compare it now with the different sizes that we have from there. So we might take out, who do you want to take out, Thanos or Hulk? Hulk. Okay, Hulk and which other hot toy figure? Anything? Yeah. So we're going to compare with the sizes because we can't even, I don't even know oh, how. Juggernaut. Juggernaut? Okay, we're going to compare with all the toys that we have with, the, with this certain size. So give us one more moment, we'll be right back. Much, much, much later. Hey guys, so we're back. So we're gonna compare it with two types of 1 to 6 scale. So this is the Mark 42 from Iron Man 3. This is the original size of the 1 to 6 scale I just put in the stand. And this is a third party by Toys, uh, Toys R Us? Toys... No, I don't know. I forgot. So this is the third party and this is Juggernaut. And this is also a 1 to 6 scale. But this one's bigger than among these two for the 1 to 6 scale as you can t tell the difference. So, we just compared it with the size, but this guy is huge. So, yeah, what can you say about this guy, dude? It's pretty big. Is, is it heavy? Not, not really. It's not really that heavy, huh? So, yeah, that's it. That's what we just want to compare the size. So, um, I'm just going to return these, uh, return this two back, and then we'll just continue reviewing this kind of um, Hulkbuster suit. So, hold on. Two hours later. So, we compared it already with the Juggernaut and the Iron Man Mark 42. So, this is the size of the 1 to 6 scale. I'm really quite surprised and the weight to it is not really that heavy but there's a certain weight. But, this is the biggest unboxing we have ever done. And the color for this is quite Gucci. The dark red color and then he has these designs that when he was getting busted and everything else. But, his his features of facing is like his head is bended this way. So we're gonna keep him in this kind of position. Like he's getting ready to like getting ready in the fight. And if you're wondering why the heck am I wearing a Wakanda jacket, because this is the time when they were in Wakanda defeating all the minions of Thanos and the Black Panther was there. And he had to wear this suit because he cannot transform to Hulk because Hulk was a scaredy cat to defeat Thanos. So there you have it. This is the unboxing for the Hulkbuster. This is the first time we received the Hulkbuster. I think uh, there are only a couple of people that who can collect the Hulkbuster. Um, yeah, this is quite Gucci. So don't forget to subscribe to the YouTube channel, like, follow the Facebook page, and check out the previous videos, the vlogs, and the other unboxing content that I have been posted in my YouTube channel and my Facebook page and don't forget to follow this on Instagram if you guys want to find my brother if you're interested or not so any last comments for this doesn't move much it's pretty big feels like um like rubber like hard rubber that's why it doesn't feel so heavy but it's good lights work I wish the elbows would have moved but then that's fine and <clears throat> details are also on point but I think it's for me it's more of an animated look rather than the real one but still good still very close everything moves fine even if it's just the shoulders and head uh, knees legs don't move so you know it stays in a pretty solid position uh, yeah that's basically it okay there we have it for this unboxing i'll see you guys in my next unboxing videos because we got more we got more iron man suits that i need to open and we might have another one because we have a wonder woman box 
coming up. So I'll see you guys in my next unboxing. Don't forget to subscribe. Follow us in our both social media platforms. And I'll see you guys on my Facebook page and my next live streams. So peace.